Oh, good morning. It's Sunday, the 1st of September 2019, and we're just setting off home. It's uh, 10 to 12, and we're just setting off home, leaving Flanella. We're going to go up to Dolgethlow, through Barmouth to Dolgethlow. Uh, uh, then we're gonna hang your left up to Bala, have a stop at Bala Lake, have a quick look there. Then we're gonna do a uh, a right turn, head north east up to um, the Horseshoe Pass. Probably say hello to the Ponderosa Calf. And then from there we'll be heading homewards from there. Lovely day. Lovely view there out over Barmouth Bay. We're going to have a steady ride home. About three hours, three and a half hours, I should imagine. And uh, we'll be back. So uh, that's the itinerary for the for the trip home. The lovely day yesterday up in Snowdonia, up to Anglesey. Uh, perfect way to finish the weekend off into this ride home. Was going to go the Eland Valley route home, but decided that uh, you need a day at the Eland Valley. There's so much to see, and just it's a waste of a uh, a trip just to ride through it and not stop and take it in. So. I'm going to hold that for another day and uh, spend a full day down there. So yeah, we'll see. We'll get the horseshoe pass in, and I believe it's a nice route. If I can remember, I've come the other direction from the horseshoe pass and down through Ballard to Dolgethwaite. I've done that other route, but uh, not this direction on the bike. Uh, she's a beautiful Barmouth. My regular haunt. A bit quieter this weekend than it was last weekend as the uh, holiday season begins to come to a close. So the town goes back to the locals for a few months. That's the time of year I really love it, to be honest. It's the quiet time. So, just September to uh, March. It's my favourite time of year for the place. Just nipping through. And we're back on the cash road then. So a bit of traffic around considering it's uh that's only the start of September really, so still going to be a few here, but last weekend it was absolutely uh, jam-packed with people. The brilliant last in there.
Cattery Driss over there and the iconic Barmouth Bridge across the estuary there, the Mordack estuary estuary down there to the right. Beautiful. What a stunning place. open up in a minute there we go what a sight for sore eyes that is Gessley now, I'll get loud. Those two people in front, we saw those twice yesterday. It's almost like we're stalking them.
Bala like. Bala like. If he want off, so I'll let him go. Well, that was a flying visit to Bala Lake. Beautiful. And now we're heading up to the Ponderosa Calf on the Horseshoe Pass. But first we're going to be passing through the town of Bala. Arms everywhere now. Right, I believe this road takes us over the horseshoe pass. So uh, it started raining again and I was debating where to pull in to put my waterproofs on. But uh, in the end I've given up and I'm just gonna carry on. And hope I don't get too wet and die of pneumonia. So uh, very shortly we should be heading up onto the horseshoe pass. Which I'm looking forward to seeing. The last time I've been at the pier was about 2015, so that's four years ago. And it was when I was running in the MT-09. Trying to get the 600 miles on for its first service. And I came up to the... Uh, the Ponderosa Cat. Bloody rain. Bit of wipe. Some big rain drops slapped me in the face and I got my visor slightly open. Oh, this is a tight one. I'm a bit wary on uh, wet roads now after my mate Kev came on. He's, uh, he's MT09 a few weeks back. So it's made me a little bit uh, nervous. Beautiful. The Ponderosa. Cafe and gift shop.
just left the uh, Honda Rosa cap and a um, Sonitaf which was really nice and now we're heading down to Flangloughlin and then home that looks a bit uh, ominous that weather ahead so yeah this is the uh, journey home now the other way sheep Quarter past two. So uh, I'm two hour and a half, two hours. You should see us home. I'm three at the A5, down to Shrewsbury, then down to Bridge North, to Dudley, and home. Like your way. Get ready for work tomorrow. the rain again. I've got a feeling this rain is uh, local to the mountains. Once we're probably through it all right out of the mountains it will uh, disappear so that's us uh, covering as much of Wales as we could of North Wales in the short spell we had very enjoyable short weekend Probably looking at getting on for 400 miles by the time we get home. It's not bad for pretty much two days. Very similar to Longmind, this approach. Uh, 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 uh. So, Right in the wet after that happened to Kev. I'm very wary at the moment. Oh, old bus coming up the hill. Old London bus. Probably is sunny. So we have had a mix of weathers today. Lovely town like Flangoflin.
nice town. Lovely town, thank you, Ashley. So that uh, open top bus going up the hill? Yeah. Part of it that's sitting I stood on the A458 I'm just coming down the hill into Bridge North now. So the green bridge in front is the Seven Valley Railway between Kidderminster and Bridge North. And we're just now crossing the River Seven. On its way down through Worcester and onwards. It reaches the Bristol Channel. So it's left for Bristol, uh, Bridge North, right for Kidderminster and the Quat Cat and straight on towards home. So I think I'm going to wrap this video up for now. So we started out on Friday evening, 30th of August. Rode down to Barmouth. Saturday, we rode um, Snowdonia National Park, Flanberries Pass, visited Betsy Coed, went up to and across the Menai Straits to Anglesey. Got our photograph taken under the longest place name in the world and headed back over the Manai Straits and back down towards Flanberries where we did the uh, Flanberries Pass in the opposite direction. Uh, we rode then down through to Bed Gallet, stopping for a cappuccino and a slice of cake on the way. From Bedgellet, we excuse me, we uh, rode up to Pendon Uh From Pendon Diedrith, we headed uh, southeast across uh, to towards Harlick, swung off to Harlick, from Harlick back down to Barmouth. Uh, that was our Saturday. Uh, we did about 120 miles. So uh, today we uh, left Barmouth at about uh, half past 11. Headed down to Dolgetlo, up to Bala, stopped off at Bala, uh, and moved on then to the Horseshoe Pass, and stopped for a bite at the Ponderosa Cap. Uh, from the Ponderosa Cap down through Flangotland on the 483 and the A5 across past Shrewsbury and then down to Bruce North and then on Worcester Hall. So all in all, mileage wise since Friday evening at about 5 o'clock to today which when we arrive around it's going to be about 4 o'clock we're looking at about 350, 360 miles. So, not bad. <coughs> Excuse me, not bad for a weekend's riding. So, as I say, I'm going to wrap this video up for now. Um, we'll be back soon with more videos. And uh, for anybody who ends up watching this at some point in the future, I hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, coming with us on our journey that Brian and myself have done over the last uh, 48 hours.